yeah, it's raining. It's raining and beautiful. Have to be very, very careful. So I'm along today, and uh, there's some kind of uh, uh, poison thing, some gas or something, I don't know what it is. Okay, this is a paddle plate uh, electro device, I want to show. This is where the lion's paw has been located. Those are not lion's paw, they are representing the fifth state or the fifth force of the universe. I must say that. Over there. Five fingers. One, two, three four small one so we can consider it as they are representing fourth state matter but actually this parallel plate electrode is also can be considered as another finger I I I consider it as a thumb finger so that means it actually has five fingers to represent the fifth force of the universe that is the actual meaning of the uh, lion's paw, which is referred to as lion's paw, and uh, Sigiria describes a uh, lot of uh, physics concepts about uh, the dark matter. Actually, they have represented model of dark matter also. So we can uh, we can think, we can uh, we can uh, guess. Maybe uh, they are representing the dark matter using those uh, input, so entrance passage with the lens power. So I'm going to get down now. Sigiria. Today I call uh, Sigiria and me. Just only. Nobody. Okay, actually I really don't want to go back because I feel like this is just my house. Actually, it's a flying ship, it's a Pushpaka Vimana, something, well, it's a, our ship, <laughs> so I need to be careful, this is the most dangerous thing, because this wall is really uh, wide, you cannot hold it properly, so getting down is not a problem, but uh, when you are climbing, it's absolutely very, very difficult, very difficult. Already, okay. 